Hello everybody, welcome to another great episode of Hillbilly Select Reviews. It is fall going into winter and two things. One, that's a great time for ciders, right? To do apple ciders. But I was looking at my playlist and I have one on there, ciders, and I only have one review. So I said, no, I got to get some more ciders and give this a fair shot. I have to give this product a fair shot. Figured I'd start off with... Plain old was started at all, I think, Angry Orchard. Now, as far as America goes, the United States, cider was a big thing back in the day. Uh, a lot of our founding fathers, you know, I'm talking about 200 years ago, enjoyed ciders. It was very popular. And I learned that there's over 6,000 variety of apple. And I learned that the type to make cider with is a particular type of apple. It's a cider apple. It's got malic acid and tannin in it. And even by itself, it's not very good at all. But it's perfect with that tartness and that uh, uh, tannin. It's great for making cider. It gives it complexity and not too sweet. And that little tartness and sharpness is perfect. Now, this particular one is out of Hudson Valley in New York, uh, Angry Orchard. Um, they own 60 acres. And what else do I need? It's 5% ABV. The reason it's called Angry Orchard, I think, is the uh, the taste of apple. I don't know. That's something to do with that. I, I read something. I can't remember exactly. Something like that. Something to do with the, uh, uh, you know, the tartness and the, and, the, and the taste of that apple. Which by itself, like I say, is no good. But for cider, very good. So, let's, what we're looking for here, of course, is, um, I don't know. Does it taste like? Apple juice? Does it taste? What's it taste like? Does it taste like um, uh, synthetic? Does it taste like candy? Go find out here in a second. You all like it? You all like ciders? We'll see. Got my Transylvania University class today. <clears throat> all right. So it's got the same ABV as a beer, as a sessionable beer, five percent. It is the color of apple juice. I guess that's not surprising, but this is made from, of course, apples and yeast. And this particular one uses a wine yeast. I smell the smell of apples from here. Let's let's get let's get up close with this. It smells like apple juice little bit of beer, nothing to do with beer, but it has a little beer smell, and apple juice, just regular apple juice, a little bit of beer, and a little bit of, almost like a vinegar type smell. I think it's going to make a good drink though, because you don't want the real sweetness like a real apple juice that comes from the store. I think you want a little more complexity than that. Let's see. Let's see what shines through on the taste. I kind of like the smell, actually. All right, so Angry Orchard, hard cider, original blend, crisp apple. All right, there it is. First off, you see a little head and bubbles. Very light, very light. On the carbonation, very light. Now, taste is uh, hmm. better than I thought. Let me tell you why. It's very acidic, which is refreshing, kind of sourish. Um, it has like a background beer taste. This has nothing to do with beer, but somehow it's reminding me smell and taste of beer a little bit. It's got the apple juice taste to it, but between the tannin and the tartness and the beer type taste and the apple put in there, it's good. I like it like that. I like that dryness. And that's another thing about that apple. It makes a nice tart, dry cider, you know, the cider apple. Um,
So, remember now, this isn't going to be just like apple juice where it's sweet and it's got a little carbonation, it's got a little beer type taste to it, it's got a little tartness, you know, the, the, um, the tannin in there a little bit. So it's a little more going on than just sweet put down apple drink. Know that going in. I like that. I like that with the complexity of the different stuff, and I think it's refreshing. Um, but it's not just like an apple juice. It's not bad. This isn't bad at all. For me, it's better than I thought. I wasn't big on ciders. I never really drank them. Like I said, I had one review on there. It was a while back. And I started looking at my playlist. I'm like, I got cider. I only got one cider, so I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to fix that for you. So anyway, um, hope you like the review, and we'll do some more ciders. Let me know what you think, and I'll know by the views and stuff on the, uh, on the, uh, you know, videos, whether or not cider's a winner or a loser. All right, everybody, from, uh, well, it's going to be a winner because it's, it's another offering and something that I want to learn about and explore myself. All right, from real, um, from... From Hillbilly Select Reviews. This is a real cider review, I should say. All right, everybody. Cheers and thanks for watching.